let's unbox the latest designer bag in my collection. Hello, 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 and the warmest of welcome to today's video. For those who haven't seen my face before, hi, I'm Nick, fab to have you here. For those who have seen my face before, thank you so much for joining me again. I hope you enjoy my videos. I plan videos roughly three times a week on a range of different topics, anywhere from fashion, slightly more personal topics. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, then please do head down, hit subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. I love chatting with you all. I'm all about living life loud, and what that means to me is being your authentic self, being proud to be you, and just celebrating who you are. Celebrate yourself, and of course, celebrating others. So, sorry for the slightly more casual attire. I wasn't expecting to film today, because I wasn't expecting this to arrive today, but I'm very happy that it has. So I popped out this morning, and I was properly dressed this morning, and then I came home, thought I'll get into my comfies, watch some TV, hang out with the kitty cat, um, and then my door went, and I'm too excited to not open it to show you. So this is why we're a little bit comfy, um, but I'm giving you full Ralph Lauren casual wear. So Ralph Lauren, Ralph Lauren, um, polo Ralph Lauren. Um, so what was I using as my bag of the day earlier when I was actually using a bag? My beautiful Mulberry Bayswater in the white and dual green. I'll insert the photo of um, the outfit. Um, so I was only going to view a cattery <laughs> to see about putting Poppy into a cattery for a couple of days. Just, just to test um, whilst I'm away um, in a few months time. So it wasn't a big trip, but um, it had to get dressed. <laughs> Couldn't go in my pyjamas, basically. Um, but I'll sit on the internet and film in my pyjamas. Anyway, that's fine. That is what it is. So, let's get into this box. And this item is from a consignment store that I found on Instagram called, and the Instagram is called Seek Pre Loved Bags, but the website is carrykind.co.uk. This isn't sponsored, this isn't a collab. Um, I sold a couple of bags um, to them end of last year? No, early last year. Um, I sold, yeah, I sold a Kurt Geiger bag and I sold a Mulberry bag to them and they were great. Um, and so I always check out what pieces they've got. Small business, so always, always looking at ways to support um, small businesses if I can as well, if they've got items that I love. So here we've got this. So in the box, we have an item that I spoke about fairly recently. Um, I took the front of the box off because it had my address on it um and i didn't want that being shown so um i have pulled off the front of the box as you can see um it's wrapped like so i've not actually looked at the item there's the air paper wrapped in tissue paper with a carry kind sticker I leave that intact if I can. It is an item from Gucci um, and it is in this Gucci dust bag. Move the box. And it is the... Oh, it's smaller than I thought it was going to be. Okay. It is the Gucci Padlock Tote. And I think this is in the medium size. So it is this lovely, lovely coated canvas Gucci Tote. It's got this great gold hardware. How do I open it? Oh, like that. So you pull that up. It's got these long shoulder straps here. Hardware goes over the top like so, and then it just clips in like that. And you just throw it on your shoulder and you rock and roll. So, like I said, it's a little bit smaller than I thought it was going to be. So I just need to see styling wise, how I feel about that. What is it comparably to? 
Yeah, so it is a bit smaller than that. Okay. We'll see how it feels styling wise because I wanted to use it as a little bit more of like a formal kind of tote. But if this fits, you know, an iPad, a bottle of water, a pencil case, a cosmetics case, then actually I think it could be just like a nice tote for every day. So less less worky and more actually just every day out and about shopping all of that kind of stuff maybe it'll be nicer maybe it's nicer for that kind of thing instead yeah we'll see how we feel styling wise so yeah so we'll see how we go styling wise i'll see what it looks like proportionally like i said i thought it was going to be a little bit bigger so i just need to see how i feel about it so condition wise it is looking good. It is looking good. There's the odd mark here and there, but it's white leather, so that's probably what you would expect. I can get at those marks as well, I'm sure. Um, then you've got a little mark there on the keys. The hardware has a little bit of, you know, scratching on it, but again, that's what you would expect. Um, you know, I've got bags that have literally been scratched from their first use. And then you've got this beautiful kind of hardware here. And the straps go through with a bar. So I wonder if you can, can you remove that and extend it? What are you doing? You're in the box, okay. See, I get a bag, Poppy gets a box. So, yeah, I don't know if these are removable. I also don't want to get into a place where I remove them and can't get them back in. Um, but, yeah, so I'm going to see how it looks on me. Um, I know I might seem a little underwhelmed. I'm not. I think it's a beautiful, beautiful bag. It's just until I get up and look at it style-wise proportionately, I can't fully make a judgment on whether or not it's the bag for me. However, do I think it's beautiful? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Um, and actually, I think it will be a super practical bag because let's open this out. Oh, it oh, that's nice. It's come with an organizer. Oh, that's really nice. So it's come with an insert, but it's got a couple of pockets. It's got a few marks on the interior. It's got a lovely, almost like suede with an interior. And then you've got that. Comes with a certificate of authenticity as well gucci medium padlock shoulder bag supreme white calfskin gold hardware hello this is from L unique london okay hey poppy and then it's got a zip pocket in the back as well like i said it's a beautiful beautiful bag so i'm certainly not underwhelmed by how nice the bag is because i think it is lovely it's just for me figuring out proportionately style wise is this going to is this going to work um let's go with this. okay so it's like a it's similar to sort of like le pliage size okay okay let's let's give it a go i'll go and sort of throw it on with a couple of things and see what i think um and then we'll take it from there we'll take it from there but it's a beautiful beautiful bag Let's see if it can work for me. So I have just had a bit of a play. I've just had a little bit of a what fits. I'll insert a what fits as well. But I have decided that I am going to keep it because I think it is a beautiful, beautiful bag. It's a similar size to the Alexa. So I wasn't sure if it was going to be a similar size to the Bayswater with longer handles or the Alexa with longer handles. It is much more similar to the Alexa in terms of its size but it is absolutely a beautiful, beautiful bag. And what I think I like about this is the fact that although it's that tote style, it's a little bit more formal with all of the hardware, with the leather trimming, etc. I think the Gucci canvas, the Cota canvas is gorgeous. Plus, I could see how I could use this as a day bag where I wouldn't normally grab a tote because let's say I'm going to London shopping or something, I wouldn't normally grab a tote for that but I think I would grab this. So I can definitely see how this could be used. I also think it would be good for work. So I'm gonna keep it. I think it's beautiful. So together, you're probably thinking, oh my God, he's using his teeth. 
There we go. Ta-da! So I now own this Gucci Supreme bag. I think it is lovely. And that hardware is really beautiful as well. It's a lovely, lovely bag, is it not? I think so. I think so. It's great. Yeah, definitely. Well, I've taken the tag off now, so we're definitely keeping it. But no, I think it's absolutely beautiful. I need to figure out how to push those keys in. There we go. So those are now not sticking out. So there we have it. That is the Medium Gucci Supreme Tote. It's lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So I'm quite looking forward now to how I can style this. Actually, I've got the outfit in mind that I'm going to wear this with, my first outfit. I know where I'm going to wear it. I know how I'm going to use it. And I know the outfit that this is going to go with. And I'll insert a photo of it when I do. Whether this, I think I will have already uploaded probably this unboxing by that point. I'll have tried, to, I'll have styled it a couple of times for the purposes of this video. But I will definitely, definitely put in some shots of the outfit that I have in mind for this as well. So there we have it. My new Gucci or new to me Gucci bag. It's beautiful. Beautiful. Looking forward to using it very, very much. It's a little bit different in my collection. It's going to be a good one. I can feel it. So there we have it. The only Gucci bag in my collection, but it's a beauty. Yay. Thank you so much as always for watching. I really appreciate it and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Take care everyone. Bye now. Mwah.